What if I told you that 70% of the foods in the supermarket contain ingredients that doctors say you should never put in your mouth? What if I told you that the kids born today will not live as long as their parents, and the primary reason is the food that we serve them? What if I told you that year after year, we're destroying the fertility of our farmer's soil? What if I told you that we're making changes to our food supply that can never be undone? And what if I told you we can turn it all around with a little thing called education? You may not know it, but in the foods you're eating are genetically modified organisms. Have you noticed that a lot more people are talking about autism? When I was a kid, no one had an inhaler. Food allergies were not a big deal. There's something going on. There's a big change in the health of our children. We think that that change comes from the food. With every single bite we take, we're part of the biggest experiment in the history of the world. In 1996, biotech companies made a radical change in our food supply. Instead of producing crops through sexual reproduction, they plucked genes out of species like viruses and bacteria and forced them into the DNA of plants like soybeans and corn. If you track on graphs the introduction of these foods into our food supply, you can see the rise of diabetes, of gastrointestinal problems, of autism, all sorts of diseases, one after the other after the other, linked to the introduction of GMOs. The GMOs contain two toxins, two poisons. One can poke holes in the cells of humans, possibly causing leaky gut. Another contains a toxin that can kill gut bacteria and do all sorts of nasty things, linked to cancer, to endocrine disruption. There are thousands, maybe millions, suffering from diseases needlessly. This is the time where education is the key. And right now, the moms are the critical piece in the entire puzzle. So many people don't know how difficult it is as a mother to discover that you're feeding your children foods that are exactly the opposite of what you're expecting. Instead of it being nurturing and life-giving, it's life-taking. So what we want to do is we want to make a series of mini documentaries that really showcase the realities behind a mother who discovers that GMOs are a primary culprit to the well-being of her family. Mothers that have had children with autism or allergies, serious diseases, that discover that a major contributor to that is GMO consumption and what she goes through. And through this very real, close, heart-gripping journey, all of us together will be educated and empowered, so we'll have the answers of how to actually get GMOs out of our diets, but we'll also reach people who don't know about GMOs and explain to them through these exposés what really happens at the dinner table today. We're looking at two futures. We're looking at the biotech future, where it's replacing nature completely with their GMOs, their designer organisms designed for greater profit and control. And we're looking at a future where we protect nature. We protect this generation and the next generation. It's our right to be healthy. It's our right to eat healthy. It's our right to feed children healthy food so that they grow up healthy. We need your help. We would like to ask your support to help fund these documentaries so that we can get the word out so that we can all be protected from this mad experiment so we can protect our future and all future generations. Thank you.